Welcome to our next video. We're talking about the Leffer curve. The Leffer curve, which was invented, to put it this way, in the 1980s. The Leffer curve indicates that there is sure a relationship between tax revenue and tax rate, which is truly for sure. Because tax revenue, the amount of money government gets, is tax rate multiplied by tax base. So the tax base, the income that is earned by people, multiplied with the tax rate equals tax revenue. But what was new about this equation, what was new about tax revenue, is to think, is to know or to learn that there is an upward sloping curve and a downward sloping curve after behind a certain tax rate, which is what was called the Leffer curve. And it was, there is a rumor, I don't know whether it was true or not, but there was a rumor, Leffer was a counselor to President Reagan, who was president of the United States in the 1980s, last century. And he was economic advisor to him. And Reagan said, I want something on tax revenue and I only read one piece of paper, not two, nor, not three, not four, just one. And so Leffer went this way. He just wrote it down on one piece of paper. And he said, Mr. President, that's the important thing to know. Tax revenue is upward sloping here and downward sloping there. So Reagan said, yes, that's a good idea. And that's what we're trying to do. And that's what they did in the 80s. With Reaganomics, tax rates were cut because if we, if we are here on this point, if we are here on this point and we would like to, of course, increase tax revenue because the government wants to have more money. So if we increased the tax rate, would it be possible to have an increase in tax revenue? And the answer provided by tax, by, by Leffer curve was, was yes, which was quite astonishing, of course. The answer was yes. With reducing the tax rate, you would get a higher tax revenue. How come? How come? The answer goes this way. If you reduce tax rate, people would have an incentive to work more, to earn more. People thereby would have the incentive to earn more, to have a larger tax base. The tax base would thereby be increased, or people would increase tax base with a larger tax base and a smaller tax rate. It could be possible, of course, to have a larger tax, tax revenue, right? So that was the astonishing thing about it. So people in the 80s of last, last century thought that using this Leffer curve would really increase tax revenue. So people would be glad to have a smaller, a smaller tax rate, thereby re-electing President Reagan in the 80s. And secondly, government would have more money would have more money earned by a larger tax revenue. That's the astonishing thing about it. So that was the idea of the Leffer curve. There were sure two problems. First problem, are we on the right side? Are we on the right side of the Leffer curve? Or could it be possible that we are on the left side? What would happen if we were on the left side of the Leffer curve and if we increased, if we decreased now, if we decreased tax rate, it would go this way. A decrease in tax rate, not having, not influencing in any way tax base, would lead to a smaller, would lead to a smaller tax revenue, thereby decreasing tax revenue, the amount of money government would get. <clears throat> so if we are on the wrong side of the Leffer curve, that's sure a big problem. First problem. Second problem, there is the will, of course, to reduce tax rates 
in order to be re-elected, which was a light, which was a nice side effect. But just at the same moment, increasing the amount of money spent, for example, on armors, on weapons, on other things like government expenditure would be would be risen. That would lead to a larger problem because you have to wait. You have to wait there. You have to wait a certain amount of time. After decreasing tax rates, tax revenue wouldn't rise instantaneously, wouldn't rise right now. But you'd have to wait a certain amount of time to have tax revenue to would to, to see tax revenue rise afterwards. So that was somehow, somehow two problems caused by Leffer curve. That's the concept of Leffer curve, which means a relationship, two sides relationship between tax revenue and tax rate. Thank you for watching. Thank you.